We begin now at the top of Daf Bezam and Aleph and Mesechem. This is Nedarim Daf 2a. The Mishnah says, Kol kinuye nedarim kinedarim. If you use alternative terms by a neder, that's the same as a neder. V'charamim kecharamim, and the same is true by cherem. Ushavuos keshvuos, and the same is true by a shvua. Unazirus kinazirus, and the same is true by nazirus by a nazir. And the Mefarish over here explains, Kol kinuye nedarim kinedarim. The ikur neder dechsivatori ishki idur neder do amar korban shani ochelach. O korban shani nenelach. The real language that's supposed to be used by a neder is you use the word carbon. So you say that your food is going to be like a carbon to me. That's how you prohibit the food. And what the Mishnah is saying is, let's say the person uses a different language. Meaning to say they use an alternative language for a neder. Like we're going to learn later on. Instead of using the word carbon, they use the word so If instead of saying the word carbon, you use some kind of alternative word like konem, nami mitzar behu benedarim. That's also going to be effective for nedarim. Kemosha asar gabe carbon. Just like if you would use the word carbon. Vechein kinuye charamim kecharamim, vechein kinuye shavuos mefarsh lekamon. All of this will be explained later on, but the same thing if you don't exactly use the word cherem, if you don't use the word shavuah, you use some kind of word that is close, that is going to be just as effective. And the Mishnah continues, ha'omer lechaveru mudrani mimcha, mufrashani mimcha, meruchakani mimcha. If a person says to his friend, I am I'm making a nether from you, or I'm separating from you, or I'm distancing myself from you. Shani ochelach, shani toimlach. He says the things that I'm going to eat of yours, or the things I'm going to taste of yours. Also, that also is going to be forbidden. That is going to be a, an effective language for a nether. And the Mefarish over here says, Mudar anim imcha kilomar hare alai kineder mashani nenem imcha, meaning you say that which is that which I'm benefiting from you. It's like a neder. O amar lemer for shani imcha b'hai loshner. You say I'm separating from you. O amar meruha kani imcha. You're saying I'm distancing myself from you. De mashma de mitzer nafshei. All of those imply that he's saying it's prohibited for him. V'lo mesani mina. It's not the person is basically saying I'm not going to derive benefit from you. V'chol hani came into lo mefarish mamish leneder de lo midchar be shum loshen carbon. The point over here in the mission is, in all of these cases, you haven't said anything, you haven't said the word carbon or any word that's like the word carbon. So that's what we call, that's what we call Havan Yodos. That's called a Yad of a Neder, meaning to say you're saying part of the phrase of the Neder, but you're not actually saying the language of carbon or any substitute word for carbon. That also is going to count and the person will be prohibited. And the Mishnah concludes, Menuda Anilach. Let's say the person uses a language of Nidoi, which is like a language of excommunication. Rabbi Akiva, Hayachochech Bazelah. Rabbi Akiva wasn't sure about this and he said one should be Machmir. And the Mefarish over here says, He's saying, it's as if we're ostracized from one another. I can't deal with you. He's prohibiting himself to him. Rabbi Akiva wasn't sure, but said to me, He said, this also should be forbidden. It is a kind of a neder. But it wasn't clear to Rabbi Akiva one way or another. And we'll continue with this discussion in the next video. And Daf Beis, Amud Beis.